Hey, the one Philly Stick here back inside of Battlefield 1, and today I am doing, yet again, enough for a library, nothing is written. Again, one of the three-part stories inside of the game. So there will be 15 of these little suckers, or fuckers. So anyway, we are starting off in Hidden in Plain Sight. We're heading towards this rock over here. Uh, so anyway, that's immediately as you start. As you can see, I have no weapon except for this knife. So, we are starting at the very beginning of the mission. Therefore, start at the beginning of the mission, and that gives you one of five. So anyways, you can see we're starting off we're in this area. I just turned around. I didn't move. So anyway, we're going to head towards this rock that's hidden over here. I actually stopped to look at it for a second. Anyway, this is the rock we need to head to. And hidden on this rock here will be our second of five books. This is a very, very small map. And therefore, it will not take you very long to get through. Just don't get the ledger and you should be fine. So anyway, number three. This one actually may take you a little bit longer. So anyway, we're going to head to the right of the tracks uh, outside of this area here. I do grab the pistol that's inside of here. I highly recommend grabbing it, uh, mostly because it actually helps. So and we're going to head over on this way. And as you can see, I am actually coming right over here on behind this rock will be our third of five uh, books for this mission. So here comes the annoying one. It gave me a lot of running. So we're going to head straight back. See that hill over there? Run towards it. So, as you run towards this, it'll take you a little while to get there. Uh, I did speed this up as fast as I could, and there'll be a little outpost out here. There'll be a tank here if you feel like a uh, more... I'm going to destroy everything instead of sneak into this area, as you can sneak into this area without getting spotted at all. Um, it's also for an achievement here, too. So anyway, that gives us 4 out of 5, so we are running back. Yeah, this one is an annoying one. Um, this one is actually is quite easy, you'll actually come across this. Very easily, you're gonna sneak in this trade car. We're gonna wait for this guy to move so we can just get going. Uh, you may have to kill this guy. I don't know. Uh, you may have to kill this guy too. But um, move this way. Head into this train car over here, which is right next to the objective. Open it on up, and you will find your next one. That's be the final one for this mission. And if you've gotten all of them for that one, you should have all of it. So anyway, we are starting on Young Man's Work. We have just spawned. We're heading to the uh, down this hill to the immediate right, and heading into this area over here where it looks like a horse stables. We're going to head to the third horse stable area, and inside of it will be our first book. Uh, do note that Young Men's Work is by far the largest map in the game, therefore it may take you a bit of time to traverse on foot and on horse. Uh, though there are arguably some bigger maps in um, in uh, the Through Mud and Blood, this one takes the longest because you're not using a vehicle and there's no really super fighting. So then we're going to head towards this rock formation for our second book. Now as you can see at the very top here there will be a campfire, little camp, and sitting inside of here will be our second book. So we'll make sure to grab that. And the third book, uh, luckily, is... Um, luckily, not many of these are in combat areas, so it actually helps. We're going to head towards the outpost. The one that's out in the very back. If you watch my Triple Bollock Bashi video, you will know exactly where I'm talking about. I'll actually probably put it on screen uh, for a few seconds so you guys can, you know, do it and shit. Uh, so anyway, we're going to come on over here and uh, make sure you grab it. Uh, actually, I may not put it on screen. I'll probably just put a card. Uh, let's go with cards. So anyway, there's the commander. We're going to have to get inside this building here. And inside of it, as soon as you go inside the door, go through this first set of doors, or doorway. And over here, before you hit the staircase, will be our third book. So make sure to grab that. So book number four, we are heading back to the horse, and we are heading towards the uh, town. So not the village. Uh, not the ruins, we're heading towards a little town village. And out here, we're going to head on the right side of the wa uh, outhouse, not outhouse, water tower, and head towards this house over here. It's on the outskirts of the area. And sitting inside of here will be our fourth book. So make sure to open it. And that'll, of course, give us our fourth book. So for our fifth book, uh, we're going to head towards the water tower. There's a water tower on the other side of this village. Uh, as you can see, just follow the way I'm going. I sped this up quite a bit, but uh, it actually goes quite simple. We're going to head towards the out outer cropping of this area, and we're going to head to this water tower. Uh, this is a water tower we're going to see later on anyway in the next mission anyway, so make sure you just come on up here, and when you reach it, go ahead and make sure just to open this little sucker right here, and that'll give us your fifth book for this mission, which actually helps out immensely. So, we're doing here the desert. As you can see, I just loaded my weapon, which happens at the very beginning of this mission. You can see I'm spotting everyone. Why? Because I can. So anyway, in this, uh, in here, we're gonna have a bunch of stuff. We're gonna need this anyway for, to complete the mission uh, without being so spotted. And there will be this version of this rifle. We're head over towards that area anyway. Um, and we're gonna have a silent sniper. We're gonna need this. Uh, you're gonna need it to do this mission without being seen. So anyway, we're gonna come over to this house right here, and in the back of it will be our first book. 
So, starting off from here, we're going to head straight forward, and there will be a rock out here. That's our second one. Now, I do speed this up so I can get over there quickly. And as soon as we do, in fact, get over there, however long it takes you, we're going to grab this. Now, there aren't any enemies in this specific area. However, there are some over to the left, so be careful. So anyway, the next one is over to near that water tower over there, one that we passed earlier in the mission, uh, in the previous mission. So anyway, we're going to go on over here, and over next to this rock little formation over here will be our third book. Luckily, these three, the first three, are very close together. Now, number four is over in the town. It's over in this general area. The only reason I sweep like that is because it's actually hidden behind one of the other houses. So we're going to head over in this general direction, and we're going to head up this little hill right here, and actually head into this little house right here. Now, as soon as we get inside, over to the right-hand side of the door will be our fourth book. Now, for our fifth book, as you can see, I have completed the codex entry for blowing shit up all at once without getting spotted. So anyway, I'm at this fifth area, third area, the first area you could have seen from the alcove, and heading into this area right here will be our fifth and final book. Once we have grabbed this book, the achievement, if you have done all the codex entries, will pop. You'll get a new weapon for multiplayer, and of course, that is a nice 40G achievement. You know, all men drown or all men down. I can't really see. I have a preview version on my screen right now. All men dream, maybe? I don't know. But anyway, there you guys go. Thank you guys for watching. It's helped you hit like if you do. In fact, want to see more, why not click on my channel, go over my channel, hit subscribe. Or you can check out the previous video where I did still doing this achievement. And as always, have a great, beautiful day, and hopefully I'll see you guys all next time.